All right. How you doing, everyone? Hey, it's been a while. <laughs> it's been a while. Uh, but today, I'm, I'm playing on a weekly server. To be honest, it is getting closer towards the end of the wipe, but there's still a decent amount of people on. And I just wanted to jump on and see if we can't whack a little base down and maybe make some plays. But we'll see. We'll see how it goes. I think I have a few blueprints on this server. I've got med syringe. Some ammo. <laughs> Explosive, but not normal. 5-5. Five, five. Uh, and not many weapons at all. So, And not much armor. So I don't have much. <laughs> I don't have much, pretty much. But hey, it's fine. It's completely fine. What could possibly go wrong? So yeah, we just head somewhere like central in the middle of the map. There's a spot between uh, like launch, airfield and dome, like right in the middle. So I think that's probably as best a spot as anywhere later on in the wipe, just trying to get some blueprints. And you know, it's probably gonna be the most populated part of the map. But yeah, like I said, the, the server is definitely not dead. There's still quite a few people active. So I'm not expecting this to be a, a walk in the park, but we'll see. The ideal situation is that we find a base that I can take advantage of maybe build over into their compound or something but yeah man it's been uh it's been a long time since i posted a video so i, I apologize about that you know i know i know you guys are keen to see more more content more regularly but yeah it, it's just gonna work in with you know my life and uh because i do this as a hobby outside of like full-time work so sometimes uh you know sometimes it's a it's a lot to do Hey, what the fuck? Kill it, man. I killed him. Go, go, go. Oh shit. <laughs> I had a garage door on him, I didn't get it. Oh, and there's ammo in the turret. What do you mean? What do you mean there's ammo in the turret? No, I forgot about the turret. I forgot about the turret. Ooh, what's this? This is like exactly what we're looking for. Just whack a door and a TC on. Fuck yeah. It's like kind of in the in the perfect spot too. He's about to try and chop me. <laughs> yeah, boy. So we'll put TC in here, I guess. We can sheet metal this off. Okay. Just need a little bit of stone. So a base doesn't explode. And then uh, we'll go hit some barrels. Look for some bases. Well, at least that was the plan. But as usual, I got distracted the moment I saw this compound. So I thought I'd check that out first.
<laughs> I feel like we can get in here. Maybe? Maybe not. Uh, be close. Maybe not. Maybe not, man. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> what? Clearly that turret's off or out of ammo. No way, come on. Oh my god. What do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean? Oh, nothing? What do you mean, dude? Holy shit. Oh, there's no ammo in the custom, though. I swear every time. Every time I jump into a compound, there's always a shit ton of sulfur for some reason. So I think we should be able to get out of here. Um, what we'll do is do one of these ones. One of these ones. And uh, one of these ones. <laughs> well, that's a pretty... Uh, that's a pretty good start. <laughs> That's a pretty good start. I haven't even got a furnace and I got 5k sulfur. I'd been on this server for less than 20 minutes and already found myself a garage door, a decayed base and 5k sulfur with a custom SMG after building into this compound. And I have to say, raid towering into compounds like this is definitely one of the simple pleasures in life. So naturally, I set out to try and continue my fantastic run and see if I could take advantage of other poor base designs. But first, I had to farm some stone because otherwise my base was gonna decay. Hey. Okay, you're getting greedy now. Back to base. I saw another compound just over the hill there. So I think we'll go check that out too. That's a pretty stacked tool cupboard. <laughs> We're good. Hell yeah. We might we yank you yank this tier two as well. Thank you. Sorry, dude. It's been quite a bit of shooting out here. It's been a spaz going off. There's that goddamn auto turret that I almost forgot about again. Man, I need to go to Outpost. I need to go to Bandit and buy some frags. <laughs> Can make a play on one of those dudes. Oh, shit. Oh, 
Oh my. Are you kidding me? <laughs> they freaking turrets. Thank you. Well, before we go any further, there's something I gotta do. <laughs> yes. Oh man, I can kill those guys. Let's make some rounds and bring out the custom. I got, just, I got no armor, like zero. That's okay. Okay, that should be enough. All right, this is a big risk, but whatever. Gotta risk it to get the biscuit, mate. Don't know if they're still hanging around. Oh, maybe they're running a uh, dome, actually. That would make sense. I mean, we can probably run dome anyway. And then, <clears throat> if we hear him up there, we'll just go down the bottom and set a trap for him. Yep, there's people up there, that's for sure. <laughs> They're actually not coming down. Sorry, mate. Jesus. God damn. I should have run. Different group, I guess. The commotion I'd started near Dome clearly drew some attention. There was fighting going on non-stop for the next half hour or so. And since I'd lost my only decent weapon in the MP5, I decided to stay away from it for the time being and use the time to do some farming and loot management in my base. That was until nighttime came and I thought I'd run back over and see if I could make a play and slip away into the night. Yes. I'm 
out. I'm out. <laughs> yes. Whew. I feel like there was an AK around there too, but I don't know what happened to that. But for now, I'm not worried about it. Just need to get this Thompson back home. Pumpy, Magnum. Hell yeah. And then we just run straight back. Let's just take Eoka, man. Oh god! <laughs> what? <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> Another pump? Oh man, I'm out. <laughs> I am out for good. It may not seem like much, but snagging some lower tier weapons like this was huge for me. It opened up a world of possibilities if I could find the right clan compound to toy with. And, not long after, I stumbled across the perfect victims. Yeah, now we got some firepower, we might actually be able to pull off something if we can, you know, get into one of these compounds. Interesting. Backwards gate. <laughs> I feel like we could jump onto that gate. Oh fuck. Wait, how do they even get to their roof? Oh shit. <laughs> I thought it was out. Oh, they get up there. Okay. Okay, so there is ammo in the turret. Good to know. But what's in the furnaces? That's uh, that's the big question. <laughs> Maybe not. Maybe not. Oh, there's another turret. Are they K sulfur? Okay. Oh, yep, I forgot about that turret. I've got an idea though. I have an idea. Okay, let's do some exploring. Oh, that's a shoddy trap. That's why I came prepared, everybody. Oh, I don't get the rounds. Wait, you can just walk in. <laughs> I built some epic, like, raid, like, tower, and you can just walk in. <sighs> God damn it. Maybe the turret stops you from walking in. Maybe that's the purpose of it, sitting there. Because it did shoot me as I walked past the base, so it kind of makes sense. In which case, that shoddy trap was probably facing the other way. Hopefully no one's trying to yoink my plan here. Shit. Oh. <laughs> Holy shit, there's another one there. Oh my god. Okay, we need to drain this one. But I should also get this back home. Let's do that first. Let's get this stuff back home. Man, that's a pretty good haul. It's like a thousand sulfur plus. 240 low grade. 
And like 2,000 metal frags almost. Not bad. And a shit ton of uh, crude too. So yeah, my plan here, by the way, is if I can if I can drain like bait one of those turrets, then I think I might be able to spear out the other one, and however many rounds is it are in it, I will get to keep the turret that's right up against the wall. I haven't actually drained at all yet, so it might be loaded with rounds. But yeah, the hard part's gonna be draining this first turret, I think. Nice. Okay, so that's the that's the turret that I ne needed to drain. That one's done. Now we're just gonna see how we go with the second turret. Yes. Yes. <laughs> He's got it. <laughs> oh, he's done it. Thirty-seven. She. So yeah, up until this point, I'd really just been having a good old time messing around with this compound while its owners were offline or at least away from the base. But just as I was about to leave, I heard some doors opening inside. So I thought I'd respawn at my base and come back over with a weapon just to see what would happen. Then he come back with an Ioka or something. If I can somehow get him to open that top door. Like, he's not gonna expect that I'm standing there. He knows. <laughs> Maybe his whole base will be open. It is an LR. Dude. <laughs> no way. Oh, I didn't get his meds. Oh, no way. I was such a potato too. <laughs> Easy LRs, boys. Oh, and metal. Metal face mask too. Oh man, I, I potatoed so bad too. Yeah, we gotta go back with a proper gun. I think we'll risk the pumpy. He came out with another LR, man. These guys must be so loaded. No way. Oh, the fucking turret, dude. Oh, I thought I got rid of all the turrets. Oh, he had an AK. No. <laughs> he had an AK. So stupid. I can't... Oh, I forgot that I hadn't got rid of that last turret. And it came back to bite me in the ass. 
Man, these guys are so loaded. He didn't even have the AK equipped, I don't think. <laughs> Damn. We're going to try and make a play here. Thank you. <laughs> oh, he's coming out again. What the hell? What's he doing? Why is he just standing still? <laughs> this, guy, this guy was kitted, right? No. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what the hell are these guys doing, man? Oh my god. What are you doing, fellas? Damn. Man, for like an hour of... How long have I been playing for? Like... Like two hours of playing? <laughs> uh, it's, not, it's not bad. That's not bad at all. It was a pretty good haul, man. In just under two hours of playing, I'd acquired a bunch of weapons and some nice tier armor. Unfortunately, I didn't have the blueprints for raiding, nor the time to farm up for a tier 3 workbench so that I could make explosive rounds, so instead I kitted up and went out to dominate the PvP scene. Get him? Nice dude. Dominate? Yeah, about that. Fuck me, man. How many fucking... You actually can't use that. You actually. Fuck me, man. Man, they're all full metal kit. I think we're gonna have to call it. Well, easy come, easy go. But man, it feels good to be back making videos. In only a short few hours of playing, I'd bonded with some fellow nakeds, made some plays, caused some trouble, and had a great time along the way. Thanks so much for watching everyone, have a good one, and I'll see you guys sometime soon.